Mrs. Christie, I'm so glad you could come. I'm one of your greatest followers. I've read all six of your books. Uh, is uh, Mr. Christie not joining us? Is he needed? Can't a woman make her own way in the world? Uh, don't give my wife ideas. Now, Mrs. Christie, I have a question. Why a Belgian detective? Belgians make such lovely buns. <laughs> <laughs> I say, where on earth is Professor Peach? He'd love to meet Mrs. Christie. Said he was going to the library. Uh, Miss Chandrakala, would you go and collect the professor at once, my lady? The date on this newspaper. What about it? It's the day Agatha Christie disappeared. <laughs> professor Peach! She just discovered her husband was having an affair. Never think to look at her, smiling away. Well, she's British and moneyed. That's what they do. They carry on. So for this one time, no one knows exactly what happened. She just vanished. Her car will be found tomorrow morning by the side of a lake. Ten days later, I get the Christie turns up at a hotel in Harrogate. Said she'd lost her memory. She never spoke about the disappearance till the day she died. But whatever it was... It's about to happen. Right here, right now. Professor! The library! Murder! Murder! <laughs> broke as he fell. Time of death was quarter past four. A bit of pipe. Call me Hercule Poirot, but I reckon that's blunt enough. Uh, worth killing for when that lot dry as dust. Hold on. The body in the library. I mean, Professor Peach in the library with the lead pipe. Let me see. Up to my way. Gerald! Please. Someone should call the police. You don't have to. Chief Inspector Smith from Scotland Yard, known as the Doctor. Miss Noble is the plucky young girl who helps me out. I see. Mrs. Christie was right. Go into the sitting room. I will question each of you in turn. Come along. Do as the Doctor says. Leave the room undisturbed. The plucky young girl who helps me out. No police women in 1926. I'll pluck you in a minute. Why don't we find the real police? Well, the last thing we want is PC blood sticking his nose in. Especially now I've found this. Morphic residue. Morphic? Doesn't sound very 1926. Death left behind with certain species genetically re encoded. The murderer is an alien. This means one of that lot is an alien in human form. Yeah, but think about it. There's a murder, a mystery, and Agatha Christie. No, oh, happens to me all the time. No, but isn't that a bit weird? Agatha Christie didn't walk around surrounded by murders. Not really. I mean, that's like meeting Charles Dickens and he's surrounded by ghosts at Christmas. Well... Oh, come on! It's not like we could drive across country and find Enid Blyton having tea with Noddy. Could we? Noddy's not real. Is he? Tell me there's no Noddy. There's no Noddy. Don't forget to click below and subscribe to the official Doctor Who YouTube channel.